Hello and welcome to a not so awesome review. And today we're looking at the Overwatch Genji Funko Pop number 347 in the line. And this guy is actually really good. Uh, the body sculpt and everything on him looks really good. The paint job is almost completely perfect. My only complaint with this guy is just I, I kind of wish he was in a better pose. Now it's not a bad pose. It's not your generic Funko Pop pose kind of like Cap was like a few months ago. But this, he, he, he looks good. He looks good. But I wish he had the sword in his hand doing some slicing, doing some effect pieces going on or something instead we have him getting ready to unsheath his shorter sword right there and holding the little stars in his knuckles in the other hand but it's just a minor complaint it's really preference i mean you guys could just honestly love the stance yourself and i'm just complaining to complain but it's not a complaint it's good i just wish it was different that's that's my uh viewpoint on this you can see the silver on the mask and everything the whole entire thing right here really good as is the silver on the stars and on the body and everything. Really nice metallic. Looks really good. The green visor thing is amazing. Looks really good, especially in the light. Almost looks like it's lit up. It isn't, but it has that look. His head can turn left and right in case you are wondering. This can't. This is glued in, so I, I wouldn't advise forcing that. Uh, the body itself looks really good. You can see he does have his little symbols right there on his chest and everything. It's really nicely sculpted. They did a lot of detail work, as you guys can see, throughout the entire body, which is really nice. You can see the uh, sword on his back right here, both of them, and just plugged in there, looking really nice. Again, the bodysuit and everything on him has been done really nice. This is a rubbery piece. And, uh, yeah, he comes with a stand, and I, I really can't say anything bad about it. I mean, like I said, do I wish it was a better stance? Yeah, of course. Uh, that's... Kind of what I said in the beginning, but is it bad? No, it's actually really good, really clean, surprisingly, and it, it's a nice mixture of a metallic, co uh, metallic color, a glossy kind of. I don't know what color white tint that is. It's not pure white, but it's like an off white, almost almost tanned white. I'm not sure, but you know the gray on it, and or not the gray. Wow, <laughs> the brown on it is like a nice matted color so it really complements each other really well so i love that the feet look good everything about it is pretty darn awesome and if you're a fan of the character in the game definitely get it because it looks good it's a nice pop can't really say much about it obviously the uh figma is i'm not gonna say like miles better but that's a completely different thing but i mean if you want one or the other I, this is a good this is a good place to start just because you know it's cheap Anyways, I'm just rambling at this point, so I hope you guys enjoyed the review. Wait a minute, because uh, I did want to say, here he is compared to Mr. I'm not going to pronounce his name, because it is too hard to for me, and I'm just going to mess it up anyway. But you can see, Genji is a good ways taller, 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 while he's a pretty good ways uh, wider. So, there you go, size comparison done. Now then, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. This was brought to you guys by the AB Pop Shop. So check out their Instagram linked in the description down below. Subscribe for more, and I will see you all later. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.